Ever wondered what causes kidney stones and how to prevent them? It's time to unravel the mystery behind these painful pebbles that can make life quite miserable. Kidney stones, also known as renal calculi, are hard clumps of crystals that take shape in your kidneys. These little troublemakers can range in size from tiny, like a grain of sand, to large, like a golf ball. Ouch! Imagine trying to pass something of that size through your urinary tract. So, what brings these unwelcome guests into existence? The first culprit is dehydration. When you don't drink enough fluids, your urine can become concentrated, creating the perfect environment for crystals to form. Diet also plays a significant role. Foods high in oxalate, calcium, and certain proteins might be tasty, but they can also contribute to stone formation. Your genetic makeup might be to blame too. If your family has a history of kidney stones, your odds of joining the club increase. And let's not forget certain medical conditions like hyperparathyroidism and urinary tract infections that can make you more prone to developing kidney stones. Now how would you know if a kidney stone has decided to pay you a visit? The first sign is usually intense pain in your back, side, abdomen or groin. You might also experience nausea and vomiting, see blood in your urine or have a frequent urge to urinate. Urination itself might also be painful, so you've got a kidney stone. What's next? First and foremost, you'll need to manage your pain. Over-the-counter or prescription medications can help. Drinking plenty of water can assist in flushing out the stones and prevent new ones from forming. In some cases, medication might be prescribed to help dissolve the stones or stop them from forming in the first place. But when a stone is too stubborn or large to pass naturally, medical procedures like lithotripsy or surgical removal might be necessary. Prevention is always better than cure, right? So how do you keep kidney stones at bay? Staying hydrated is key. Make it a habit to drink plenty of water throughout the day. Watching your diet can also help. Limit your intake of foods high in oxalate, sodium, and animal proteins and up your consumption of fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. While calcium is good for your bones, too much from supplements can up your risk of kidney stones. And of course, if you have a history of kidney stones or experience symptoms, don't hesitate to seek medical advice. In a nutshell, kidney stones can be a pain, literally. But armed with the right knowledge and taking proactive measures, you can minimize their impact. It's all about understanding the causes, recognizing the symptoms, knowing your treatment options, and taking steps to prevent them. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more health-related content. Thanks for watching.